Hello Taurus and welcome to your reading. Today I'm going to start with the Energy Oracle. And then I'm going to go into the Secrets of Tarot deck. Alright, well, let's see what messages God has for you guys today. Go ahead and shuffle this deck. And then we'll get into it. And this time when I'm starting to record, it says 12 12. Um, that could be something significant, so definitely look that up. And I also just seen 33. Those numbers that you can definitely research. You know, numbers. Shoot! Oh, that was me. Alright. Let's get into this thing. Maybe. All right, God, what messages do you have for Taurus today? I'll do it like this. One more. Beautiful. Thank you. All right. Ooh, the first out we have is the happy family. So I feel like some of you guys are really focusing on what's going to make your family life happy. Oh, this could be like a relationship that you're already in. This could be like wanting to get a hold of them hearing. I'm also seeing the rainbow something about like blessings coming in for your family as well. For those of you guys who already have one. Okay, next we have the uh, oh that's funny. You know, four and then five, right? Well, then we have the attachment card. So I feel like there's something from the past that you need to let go of. This could be some I'm hearing some way of thinking that's holding you back. Yeah, whatever this is, it could be holding you back from healing and having that happiness that you truly do want for yourself and your family. But we also have the second chakra archangel ariel that came out with that and that shows me there that you needing to balance yourself out i'm hearing you needing to find that work life balance um that's going to be very beneficial for you guys we have a woman holding the heart um and also really getting into that heart space your heart chakra opening yourself up for those of you guys who are single to new love and for those of you guys who aren't just open yourself up more. Um, so I'm hearing to loving yourself, to healing, and to working on yourself. You know, the door to spirit here. Some of you guys, I'm hearing needing to pray more. Um, there's something that's been on your mind. You needing to pray, let go of it, and let God um, handle it for you. And then, wow, look at that. The card number 11, we have the cornucopia. So that's going back into that happiness. I feel like once, whatever it is, that you've been attached to from the past you need to pray on that you need to let that go you need to do some healing from within from your heart chakra really balance your life out as well and give things up to god whatever it is that's been stressing you whatever it is that you're worried about you need to pray on that and to allow god to handle it for you all right let's see and then i feel like you will have that happiness that you truly do want um and envision for your life and for your family well, as I split the deck, we have the three of pentacles. Okay. I feel like that's like stable foundation working with others. This is a tower. So I feel like there's a huge change. I'm hearing a shift that's coming in for you guys. A shift that's coming in for your life. I'm hearing by next year. Some of you guys, it could be early next year as well. We have the page of wands. So this is something that could be communicated to you. Um, or just action that needs to be taken. Like a little bit of action. Which we kind of already went over. And then we have the Five of Pentacles. So the Five of Pentacles is that left out in the cold energy. That's, again, that's something that you're attached to from the past. That's not so good. You're allowing that to hold you back. Then we have the Six of Wands that I've seen. I feel like you're going to be victorious against whatever this is. You just need to put in the work and the effort to really heal from it. All right, let's see. Let me try to get one more. Perfect. Thank you. All right. We have the Eight of Cups. Yeah. So with the Eight of Cups, I feel like you can have some issues. And you see, he's just kind of looking away from the blessings that he does have here. So I feel like with that too, it's like needing to be a little bit more grateful for what it is that you do have. Focus more on that than the issues. On the bottom it says, money problems, turning your back and walking away, knowing nothing more can be done. So again, with that attachment card that we've seen, walking away from that is going to be very important justice again that reminds me of balance which she has a balance scale here but it also says the legal situation or document police finding out the truth in the matter 
affecting the balance. So some of you guys, in order to really heal, you need to really reflect on yourself and on the truth of the matter and the situation. And what it is that you can do differently to move forward. We have the lover's card here. So again, like I was saying earlier, with the woman holding the heart right there, um, really opening up your heart and yourself to the love and this happiness that you truly do want with someone. I feel like that happy family there. This is a couple. This is someone who wants to be with this other person and really working on things. On the bottom it says love, love affairs, romance building, again, within a marriage, relationship, relatives, loving relationship that you could share with a friend. So, you know, it can go, it can go any way, but I feel like this is not mainly for either someone who wants a marriage with someone, someone who's in a marriage or in a commitment um, and wants things to go to the higher level. Then we have the page of wands here. That's funny. Did I even see that while I was shuffling? Like, I think so. I seen one of the wands card. Anyways, but you know, this is just about moving forward. I feel like it says traveling over land. So maybe some of you guys are taking a trip, but I feel like this is mainly like a journey within that you're taking to that happy place, to that happiness within yourself. All right, so that has been your reading. Thank you guys.